Hello everybody, welcome back to Let's Play The Binding of Isaac. Not gonna do a challenge run, just gonna do a regular run as Cain, because I'm kinda, I did that no item run, and now I feel like I just wanna kinda get my skills back, and I wanna see you know, what kind of items I could possibly come across, because I still have not gotten every item in the game, despite having like 40 hours in Isaac right now. So for everyone who leaves comments asking, you know, is this game worth the $5? Well, let's put it this way. I have about 40 hours into the game right now. That's about a dollar for every eight hours of play. You can probably not find a better value than that. <clears throat> also, everyone was asking for drunk playthroughs. That might not happen. It might happen, indeed. But I am pretty goddamn hungover right now, and I hope that's good enough for you. But I'm going to do my best to be engaging at the same time. So what item do we have here? Mom's pill bottle. Could be good, in conjunction with Kane's luck foot. Hey, there you go. Got an HP up right off the bat. So I'm expecting... There's no end to that sentence. I'm actually expecting. I'm having a baby. No, I'm just joking. But, <clears throat> I'm expecting that this is going to be a pretty easy run, because I've been doing all these challenge runs, and you know, like, my Isaac fundamentals largely are pretty good. we got a large champion monstro here. But, uh, I'm feeling like, uh, you know, I basically, I have the skills required to take down this game consist Monstro, can you jump at me please? It's gonna make this a lot faster, thank you. So I'm feeling that as a result of all that, that training I've done in the challenge run, I'll be much more well equipped in order to take on a vanilla run here. It's like when you know, Russian hockey players train by skating with parachutes behind them so they skate faster when there's no parachutes. I've created these impediments, impediments? Impediments, so that when playing a vanilla run, I can do much better. So my goal here, I don't know if I have a goal, my goal here is to beat Mom's heart and get an interesting, possibly overpowered set of items, which, you know, doesn't seem to be too far away from the norm. I wish I had some damage up, though. This monster took fucking forever. It's cool, though. We got full health, as well as a speed up, which is not really that useful, but it's better than nothing. And in fact, coming from that run where I didn't touch any items, kind of feels like a goddamn Christmas present, just to be able to increase my speed a little bit. Also going to be really effective on the off chance I get the ability, or the opportunity I should say, to do that uh, cave boy achievement where you don't get hit in the cave. For now I'm just focusing on my diagonal shots and I apologize for my stunted commentary. There's literally liters of ethanol pouring through my veins right now, making me wish that I had never done the things that I did last night. Okay, that's what makes it so great. Let's take out these flies. I uh, almost got hit there. Have I been hit in the basement yet? I don't think so. I did have some some health down, but that's because I was missing some hearts, I should say, but that's because I got that health up. <clears throat> Which I don't think gives you the heart right away. Like an HP up, if you eat dog food or spoiled milk in real life, <laughs> in the game, uh, it gives you the heart as well as the heart container, but I don't know if the pill does that. Maybe yes, maybe no. More hearts I can't use. And hey, use, use pride. Pride tends to be not so hard. I almost got hit there. Good practice. Don't take any damage in the basement. Makes it much more likely that I won't take damage in the cave. Maybe. I always hate the way those bombs interact with each other. It makes it kind of unpredictable. But pride will die. We get a lover's tarot card, which will give us two hearts shops there, but don't really need to go there right now. So we'll just check out over here. Do I, I have no bombs, which is a damn shame, because there's like 13 cents right there. I've really got to find some bombs. Luckily I have a key so I can go to the item room. And maybe there'll be bombs contained in there. Hey, there's a tinted rock right here as well. I really hate this layout here. When I take damage on the basement, it's oftentimes to these guys. But this is still better than the layout that actually gives you the turrets. Ugh! God, how prophetic was that? It was the stupidest damage I've taken in a, in a long time. Just standing there. And our pill will be... Whoa. I used the tarot card by accident. God damn it. Speed up. Ah, that's good enough. Absolutely can't complain about that. Can't get to any of that stuff without a bomb. Hey, we got a little Gish following us, around, following us around, which is good. Gish obviously shoots shots that slow. Uh, fortunately, I really need some bombs, so let's shoot all this fire in the hopes that a bomb will drop. If not, then we're abandoning a lot of good stuff on this floor, including 13 cents. That's what I would... Use. Ah! That's what I would use my, my bomb on, first of all. One cent. Alright, well, 
fair fucking trade, I guess. I'm gonna be fighting champion Duke of Flies here. I'm not sure how effective Gish's uh, slowing effect is gonna. Be. Oh wow, nice shot, dude. I've already taken out like almost half of his health already. I'm not sure how effective the slowing is on him, but it does seem that it makes it so he shoots out less flies, which is important because that actually allows me to do some fucking damage to him. Otherwise. Takes fucking forever to take him out as a result of the fly shield that he creates. One more. Ah. Hey, HP up. And the ability to make a deal with the devil. Let's see what we got here. We got the cat, which I don't like. And we got to deal with the devil. We'll take that to do some increased damage. Plus, it just makes your guy look badass. So now that we're doing some increased damage, it should be faster for us to take out these rooms. Remember when make making deals with the devil was like fucking impossible? Ah. Oh, well, I've already taken damage on the caves in the first room. I remember, like, when it used to be that making a deal with the devil was, like, definitely going to end my playthrough, or at least put me at a significant risk. Uh, but now, making deals with the devil is, like, the key to success a lot of the time, particularly if he has a nail, of course. Which oftentimes he does, but that's okay. I really like having increased damage. Like, at this point, I'm basically like Judas, but I have increased speed. And all of those upgrades that I've already gotten dropped so far. Magician, then will give us homing tears for a room. And hey, Loki's horns. This is going to increase our, uh, our tears. Also cause tears to shoot out in all four directions sometimes. But we went... Hey, hey. There we go. Might not see that for a while. It seems to come out or happen randomly. It's probably not random. It's probably based on a, a timer or something. Or a frequency. But I don't know. There's a chest we can't get to. Really feeling this lack of bombs here. Hopefully, I didn't walk over one, or I, I'd look like an idiot right now. Murder this human popcorn. Feeling pretty good about my setup so far. Money I can't get to. Whoa, 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 whoa. That was difficult to dodge as a result of the, the fact that all those bullets are moving at different speeds. What do we have in here? Well, hopefully, some bombs. No, just pills. Hey, the pills, the pills give us a pretty fly. That is a good upgrade on Kane's part. Let's use our tarot card as well. This mom's pill bottle is almost ready to go. Why? Oh, I'm, I was like, why am I shooting homing shots? Oh, right, because of that tarot card I used literally two seconds ago. Wow, things are much, much easier to kill now than they were in the last video, where I was using default Maggie. Though she does have the same power as I think. My mistake that I've mentioned many times, she is weaker. All three shooting at once. Yeah, my, my guy's too fast. I keep walking into these things by accident, or almost walking into them. Hey, there's some bombs. And there's the boss. I guess, well, Lust is going to be pretty easy to take down. But now that the slowing effect is working on it. Wow. We got lots of pills. Let's use this. Range up. Fantastic. And this pill, or mom's pill bottle. Oh, turned me retarded. That's okay. And there was some place I wanted to use a bomb back here. Where was it? I think it was back in this chest room here. Yes, I will use a bomb right here. Hopefully there's more bombs in this chest. Well, keys, as well as some money. That's fine by me. Let's come back in here. Don't need to do a full exploration here. Let's go fight the boss right away. It's a damn shame that I took damage on this floor already. And we're going to be fighting a regular version of Fistula. The slowing effect should be really useful here if I could actually get it to hit. Whoa. You can see we've already got one silkworm down. Oh, up, 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 up. There's three silkworms down, and they're nearly done already. Maybe I can make another deal with the devil. Hopefully, uh, only cost me spirit hearts. Maybe I'll get an HP up, and then I'll be able to make another deal with the devil. Again, if I get the nail. And that would pretty much end the video right there. Because I could not be stopped. Say, well, I got the HP up. There's half of the prophecy coming true anyway. Now down into the caves, part two. Part two. For my French speaking viewers. Of which, um, no, probably a few, maybe. Or a few. Yeah, I'm not trying to make fun of French people. I'm actually. I have French ancestry myself, as evidenced by my last name, which. Maybe some of you know, but I'm not going to say on camera. There's a shop that I still cannot really make use of. Circle straight for it. Yep. Okay, there we go. Perfect timing there. 
where would the boss be? If I was the boss, where would I be? I guess at the office instead of making videos for YouTube. Ah, that's a stupid way to take damage again. I just kind of sat there and let it happen. But that's cool. In terms of health, I am doing absolutely okay. The tower, that spawns, spawns bombs all around us. So if I find a room with some stuff in it that I would like to get, I can probably just use the tower and hope that the bombs end up doing what I want them to do. Pills I can't get to, but Mom's pill jar is almost recharged. Ah, uh, walked into the fly. I'm almost out of spirit hearts. But there's the boss. Before we fight the boss. Ah, uh, more retarded pills. I guess we might as well take the retarded pills. Got this extra bomb down here. I wanted to mention, a couple of people have... Well, not a couple of people. A fair amount of people have mentioned... You know, Isaac's cool and all, but it's starting to get a little stale. Two videos a day, we're up to like episode 42 or something by now. Bound to happen. So, starting maybe this week or next week, you're going to see more of a focus on other videos on the channel. We're going to get back to doing some Let's Hates. Uh, maybe another Let's Play, which I haven't decided on yet. Let's use our bomb. But definitely, things are going to get a little less Isaac focused. But still, for the people who love Isaac, there's going to be tons of Isaac, because I still really like the game. But rest assured, there's something for everyone here on Northern Lion TV. Oh, get him out, him out. One more guy down. And of course, it goes without saying that I will be playing the Halloween update when it comes out as well. A new playable character, which also needs to be unlocked. Oh, there we go. That looks like my uh, graphics changed for a minute in that room. They got a... My detail went down. Which is fine, I guess. It's starting to... It's starting to lag a little bit. Starting to chug, the word I was looking for. Oh, it took a lot of damage in this room, but that's okay. Just gotta find the item room now. There, finally! So much for the cave boy achievement, right? As usual. Continue. Doing what I do here. Come on. Come on! There we go. Don't really need that key, so I won't waste a bomb to get it. Speed up! Pretty shitty item, considering I'm already, like, the fastest motherfucker on Earth. And then we'll just go fight the boss. Well, Again, I am definitely in the region of too fucking fast for my own good right now. Let's go down, down, down. Of course, the Halloween update, new playable character, and also two new levels after the womb. So that may, uh, increase the challenge level of the game. Again, that should be nice. Hey! We got, a uh, Chad here. He'll drop little Chad when he dies, which gives us hearts, which is useful. It's gonna continue to give us more and more of a, of a fantastic arsenal here. Improve our chances when it comes to taking out Mom's heart slash it I love the look on sorry, this is Chad. Yeah, I love the look on Chad's face when he poops out some of those flies. It looks like he's really in considerable pain. Get out of here. Stay as far away as I can from those flies so I have a chance to actually dodge the bullets. Whoa! Almost got hit there. That's unprecedented. Out of the question. I slowed his butt down, but not his entire body. Ah, there he's dead. Full health again. Mom's pill jar is ready. Pill bottle. Oh, I didn't want to use that. God damn it. Okay, get the pills. Bad gas. That's a terrible pill. And okay, now we got little. Ch Where did I get? Did you see that brother Bobby there? Gish turned into brother Bobby for a room. Very strange. Very strange indeed. Uh, getting pretty good at taking out these gluttonies. With my speed up, I can quite easily get around them here. One more. Excellent. Oh man, that was terrible. <laughs> I thought I could do my diagonal walking, but it didn't work. Speed and damage. Well, I got a white turd on my head. That's indicative of liver function or liver fail failure. All right, I can barely speak. Gotta stop playing video games. Go back to school. Brain guy down. Oh, Jesus. Okay, we'll definitely blow up this rock here so I can get to this chest. Hopefully some hearts, some bombs contained within. Hey, more pills. Speed up, why not? I don't think I... Whoa. Whoa, I am fast now. I was going to say, I don't think I can uh, actually get more speed. I thought my speed skills were maxed, but perhaps not. Yeah, a couple more of these guys going down. It's making circle strafing pretty damn easy. Hey, there's a 
apart from Chubb. Yet another pretty fly. He's got a pretty nice uh, arsenal of flies surrounding me right now. Room full of leapers. That's a problem. But hopefully I can hit some of them with a the slowing effect and then actually take them out. Yeah, there we go. That was a really good run there. More retarded pills. I'll use those right away because why not? This is a shitty room. Very, very bad layout uh, for taking on leapers. And we've got a champion leaper in here as well. So we can be one-shotted by that champion leaper. But I'm going to try to do my best not to die here. Leapers have ended far too many of my videos. Hey, excellent. So we'll use bomb here. There's a tinted rock. Some spirit hearts, maybe. Those are definitely useful right now. But unfortunately, no keys to get to that treasure chest. Hopefully, I'll find some keys at some point. And I can go to the shop as well if I get some keys because there is almost 15 cents in my bank account right now. It's more money than I have in real life. No, I'm just kidding. So, oh, there we go. More bombs. So I could actually purchase maybe like a battery or something. I could use a better spacebar item than uh, mom's pill jar. Why do I always say pill jars? It became a thing after that one time I made that speaking mistake. Oh, yeah, just walked directly into the guy. Smart move. Again, my speed is too fucking high. I'm like Usain Bolt here. Like the third Usain Bolt reference I've made in this Let's Play. Pills, speed up. Why not? It's like, yes, man, I will always say yes to the pills. I could possibly rebrand this as a challenge run. Where I only do speed up upgrades. And failed miserably because I took a variety of upgrades. And I'm doing a lot of damage here at the very least. And if it ever comes down to like a Binding of Isaac racing game, I know that I would probably win. This is a really good room layout to be facing Larry Jr. on. Uh, because he will almost never come back here to get to you. There you go. That was quick. More money. Enough money to buy. Potentially a battery or something. Or something. Maybe a ladder. Or an, uh, sometimes there's HP upgrades in the shop as well. These brains will die. And then we will immediately go fight the boss. Because why not? The boss is going to be monster too. Which means he could drop anything. And the slowing effect is going to be really useful on monster too. And if I could just goad him into shooting his laser. Come on, man. There we go. Now I should be able to catch him in the cycle of... Going laser to laser. God help him if he ever speeds up. Oh, Slow him down, Gish. Do what? Thank you. This has been a really good uh, monster two fight so far. Use your laser. Yeah, there we go. Slow him. Hit him with the slow. Turn down the suck. There we go. Excellent. Another HP upgrade, and I'm back to full health. We'll go down to the depths part two, where we will be fighting Mom. Hoping for a better item at some point. Uh, because otherwise, I could be in some trouble in that mom fight. The mom fight for me is so much harder than the, uh, the heart fight. Chariot, hey, that's the unicorn horn. That'll be useful for me on, on some rooms. Maybe against the boss. Not so much on this room. Ah, let's use it on this room. I, I hate all of these enemies. Get the zombie! Excellent. That worked out really well. We've got a key here. I will not go to the arcade just yet because I want to save my money. More range up from Mom's pill bottle. Yeah, you you caught me. I almost said jar there. Oh, a room full of bomb flies again. Hopefully the slowing effect will be useful. Here. So just blow one of the chain reaction. When you blow up a bomb fly and it blows up other bomb flies, ah, fuck. it should uh, play the sound that it plays in Peggle when something amazing happens. That would be so much more rewarding. Okay, okay, get. There we go. You must. God damn, detachable heads. I need some piercing shots. I can't cope with it. Where did that guy come from? I didn't even see him. Shit, pretty fly saved me. Now, just this corpse. There's a bomb. I'd rather go to the item room in the shop right away. Hopefully, I'll get another key so that won't be an issue. I won't have to uh, make a choice. Oh! Chubb, drop some hearts for me. I don't want to backtrack. My laziness. It's an affliction. The lovers, hey. Ask and ye shall receive sometimes. Room full of leapers. I want nothing to do with this. So at my earliest convenience, place a bomb. Get the fuck out of town. That was a dead end anyway. Oh, there's a 
town in bumfuck nowhere, I don't want to be here anyway. That was a reference to nothing. I just briefly went insane. Okay, wait. Uh, kick. Oh, these motherfucking zombies. Drop something. Or I will end your on. Which way are you facing? I can't tell. Also, stop wearing blackface. It's really offensive. It's in poor taste. I just thought I would tell you. Alright, so I've actually gotta kill this room. And leapers have you know, been a notorious sore spot for me. But that actually worked out pretty well. And here we got PhD for better pills. That's uh, really, a really a good item to have in conjunction with our mom's pill bottle. I only wish I'd gotten it sooner, but that's okay. Let's take out all of these laser bullet flies. Tarot card is the tower. Mom's pill. Whoa, I didn't mean to use that. I wanted a pill. Oh, but I found a secret room. And we got another pretty fly. That'll be the third one going around us. That's a pretty good secret, or a pretty good pill to get. Three more cents to come down here. Hey, there's the boss room. We can fight mom right away, if we so choose. Do I so choose? Good question. Hey, there's a chest that I can't open. Come on, guts. Do, 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 do you have it? Our pill, bad gas. Well, that's not so good. Do I want to fight mom right away? Not really, but let's do it anyway. You never know. Could go well, could go poorly. Let's get her with poison damage. Fantastic. This is the first time I think bad gas has ever been useful for me. If we slow the leg, does it actually slow down? This is going really well so far. Almost almost too well. I'm freaked out. Yes! Destroy your own minions! It makes my life much easier. It's been an incredible fight so far. Oh, come, wait. Oh, get out of there! And I did get out of there. Amazing. Don't focus on the minions. Focus on mom. She'll kill her own minions. It's the worst, worst kind of evil lord. Mom is very nearly dead. I've almost taken no damage on this boss fight, which would probably be the first time that's ever happened, except for the time that I used the Bible. There's times that I used the Bible, I suppose. Where's the, where's the foot? Oh, pretty fly saved me from getting hit right there. I think pretty quiet saving for getting hit a number of times, actually. There we go, more foot action. Just the way I like it. Oh, there we go. And Mom will be dead now. That was an unbelievably good fight against Mom. Feeling pretty good about my chances. As we move downwards into the womb. Sounds like I'm a gynecologist giving you know, procedural notes. We will now move downwards into the womb. Also, all gynecologists have strange European accents of nondescript origin. Wow, this room is chugging along in here. It is. This game is performance heavy. I've mentioned that a few times on camera. And the problem is that when it gets kind of chuggy like this, it tends to cause sound sync issues. And if that is indeed happening as you're watching right now, I apologize. I've done my best to minimize that. It's just a, it's a known error in Camtasia. I'm doing my best to alleviate it by minimizing the performance issues that the game faces. Oh! Now, now I'm thinking, like, is it possible for me to get the womb boy achievement to not be hit in the womb? Could it happen? Well, this this room could put a damper on that. It all depends on whether I run into leapers. Leapers will end me faster than anything else in this game. Except for diglets sometimes. Half heart. And more hearts. Well, if I do get hit, I can always just... Well, stop, get, get. If I do get hit, I can always go back to that room and get some help. Go. Oh, excellent. Pills ready. More speed up. Why the hell not? Oh, I know. Because I'm going to damage myself. Ah! My achievement! My potential Chivo! Oh, I found a dead end here. It's a damn shame. Increases the amount of time I'm going to be spending in the womb, but this has been a fast run so far. There's a key that is probably going to be unnecessary for me. I've got this heart. Hopefully we get to fight Skolex, because Skolex is probably the easiest boss in the game. I've had pretty good luck getting Skolex as well recently. Oh, uh, walk directly on the spikes just because my momentum carried me. 
put a bomb here. I thought maybe yeah, those would be secret rocks. In the womb, there's still secret rocks, tinted rocks. They're just indistinguishable from regular rocks. Brain guy's dead. It's like two hearts of damage in here. That's, that's too much. Luckily, I got a half heart there. I'm Chubmeister, and we'll walk backwards to get some health. Because why the hell not? Pill jar is almost ready to use. Where's the pill jar? Pill jar! Sounds like a, like a demon, or a, an orc from Lord of the Rings. More keys that will probably be useless for me. Oh, not really a tough room, but if these diglets surround me, it could be kind of tricky. This is a similar room to the one that ended my last, or a, a few challenge runs ago. Twice in a row, in fact, this, this diglet room took me out. This money, I have not spent any money so far over the course of this video, which is pretty amazing. You could also call this a no shopping run, I suppose. Hey, we'll just kill our guy here. Our buddy. The devil card, that gives us increased damage for a room. I'm not gonna use that right now. I will take out these guys the vanilla way. The northern lion way. Oh. Almost got, well I did get hit, but I almost got hit by myself there. So what is that guy on some bombs, or sorry, on some spikes. There's more hearts left over, I should be able to pick those up, because I am taking damage like a motherfucker right now. Uh, get, 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 get. I'm at a loss for words here. I really don't want Diglett to become my new nemesis. I like him so much. He's so good when you're doing uh, the third gym in Pokemon Blue. More speed up. Oh god, I used the devil by accident. It's like the fourth time that's happened. And I wanted to use my pills and ended up using my tarot card set. I said I would go back for the health and then I didn't do it. Get out of there. Holy shit, get out of there. Okay. This is a problem. This, this could be the end right here if I don't pay attention. Let's knock these guys out of their protective cytoplasmic domains here. Some diagonal shots. Wow. This game can't handle all the shit that's going on on screen right now. Okay. We're gonna get out of this situation alive. You're gonna make it, Isaac! I mean, Kane. Go back for that health, and then I guess we will fight the boss. There's no better time than now, most likely. Ooh, but I can only take two hits, so I gotta be careful, especially if we're fighting death. If we're fighting death, it's gonna be a close fucking call. Oh, we're fighting blast. Whoa! Okay. Didn't realize that. Oh, so this is basically Monstro here. Have I fought this boss on camera before? I don't think so. Oh. Okay, well, I've definitely fought this guy on camera before. About a second and a half ago. Took a hit. So I gotta be much more careful now. Please! It's like fighting two monsters at once. God, get, get, pretty fly, save me! I got so lucky that could have been the end. So many bullets! And their lives. My speed up is making it almost impossible to dodge. I know that sounds counterintuitive, but it's true. Oh man, will I survive the fight? Indeed, but close call. Half heart and tears up. Well, oh, there's another full heart there too. It's gonna be close to see if I can survive the wound part too. It's gonna be largely dependent on the kind of rooms that we end up fighting. Got these guys before I, before I deal with myself. Good, good, good. Now, I'll just put a bomb in this guy's arsenal. What? There we go. Thought maybe he was immune to bombs. That would have been disastrous. Oh, fuck, this is a tough room, too. I just hammer away. Get the brain guy to split into smaller brain guys. Extraordinarily important. Go, take him out, take him out! I've got increased range on them, that should have been easier than it was. We'll use a bomb to get to this tarot card. Maybe it's the lovers. The chariot, that's good too. That'll save me in a room. This room. I hate these motherfuckers. There we go. Well worth it in my eyes. And I will absolutely get to the chest. It's two half hearts. That's important. Let's move to the right here. Coming up to a terminus of some sort. 
Man, do I hate these fists. Fetuses, no fucking problem. Method to take them out is standard. Standard practice. But. Sis, I have no fucking idea. Stand still for two seconds. Pills are ready, health up. Useful if I could ever find more hearts. Whoa, okay. The room. Getting a lot of those enemies that just fire a shit ton of, like, crossfire bullets at you. That's the industry term, crossfire bullets. Whoa, oh, the, the champion version of Peep. Kind of a rough draw, but I think it's got less HP than a regular Peep because I seem to be taking it out really quickly. Gotta be careful not to walk under the creek by accident. Whoa, almost got hit, I think, pretty fly. Might have saved me. Uh, da, 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 da. Get out of there, this... This is a terrible situation to be in. The creep is disappearing so slowly. The peep will be dead soon. Peep creep. I never even noticed that. Drop some hearts, please. All right. Well, the lovers. That'll do too. Two more hearts and a half heart. Almost back to full health. Unfortunately, this is not the boss room. I think I can beat this room without getting. <laughs> it's gonna... Ah! Of course, I was gonna say I think I can beat this room without getting hit. These cysts keep appearing where I'm trying to go. That's not cool. Some hearts, please. Bombs. Well, I can use those to get out of a room. If I end up fighting... If I end up even getting the mom's heart, this could be a close fight. Actually, the fight against mom's heart is probably easier than... almost any room I, I'm gonna come across here. Fucking... Lasers. This will be the end. Almost assuredly. Whoop! Hit the laser with your bullets. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, great, another version of Peep. Can't wait. Peep just fucking loves ruining my shit. Get out of there. Watch out for the eye. Oh, that didn't even look at the eye as it was coming for me. Well, anyway. That was a decent run. I had a good time. It was a nice change of pace from the challenge runs. Thank you guys for watching. Let's play The Binding of Isaac. Hope you're looking forward to more Binding of Isaac and other content in the future. See you next time.